So moving on, we've got lovely Esther here. Now, Hello, Esther. if you don't want to go for a powder, I'm a huge fan of the gel bronzers. Oh. Now, a lot of people get scared by these, but this is the best way. You know, everyone's into this looking at your skin, making sure your skin looks like your skin. This is the best way to get a natural tan. Um, without using powder because a lot of people don't want to use powder also slightly older people don't want to put loads of powder yeah, on yeah. Can we just have a look? It's not ah! the, yes, okay, that's scary and also mine's a little bit stained from earlier because I used mine this morning um, But it's absolutely beautiful. Is it Take all over brush. your body? I wouldn't, I'd just keep it on the face because this is mainly for the face, but it's also great for mixing with your foundation if your foundation's a little bit too light when you go on holiday. It's perfect. So There was one in, the, uh, one in the 80s called Tant Creole Oh, I do. <laughs> yeah. for my time. We used, to, like that. we used to play around with that. Sarah Green. Sarah Green really? made me put it on. Crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is quite old school. This is really an old technique in makeup that's coming back. Oh, and, it's, and as you see, I look like here, a mahogany sideboard by the time <laughs> I finish with that. Up. You do have to work quite quickly because it's stained, so it's really good for this time of the year because it's it's it doesn't come off with water or sweat. So oh, it's really? perfect. No, so it slightly stains your cheeks. Now again, I'm using a synthetic brush. I'm using like a contoury kind of brush that I'd use for foundation, and I'm just very simply again where the sun would naturally hit so you. So it's not an all over jobby? No, it's definitely not all over. I again would use it exactly how I'd use a powder but just use it in with a, you know, you're using the same brush like a synthetic brush and you're just simply going where the sun would naturally hit you and go underneath and I just think it looks really pretty mm -hmm. but you can still see the skin underneath it. Yeah, yeah. And again, really good for boys as well. Again, I use it for boys. It looks like your skin. It's not too heavy. But take note, you've only used a tiny bit. A and really it's done small the whole amount. Face. And I will say that that will now stain my hand a little bit. It does come off, but it's, it is a more of a stain, so it looks more natural. OK. All right. Be yeah. be better. Couldn't you put that on like a palette or something rather than do it on your hand? You can absolutely do it on a palette, but Philip, I like to get messy. OK. Yeah. But no, you should probably do it on a palette. <laughs> What's I just this? use my arms. So this is another favourite of mine. This is a jet, this is a um, cream eyeshadow, mm. right? Again, it's a bronze colour. I actually use this today. It I have nice. it. I love it. Lovely. It's so easy to use as well for women. It's just quick. And if you're a busy mum, it, you know, you don't have time. It's also water resistant. It's perfect. So I literally just pop it all over the eye. It instantly gives a beautiful kind of bronzed effect. Which I think is gorgeous. That is and just such buff a nice it into color. the skin. And Actually, it really that's does like stay the perfect bronzy brown colour, I would gorgeous. say. It's gorgeous. And it's so simple. And is cream be a creamy sort of um because is it better for older eyes? It or can, powder? What's do you know the better what? one to I use it on both. I think this is great because it's not you can't make any mistakes with it. So you, it's you, you just can quick, smudge it out a bit and, and it won't drop. Out. Yeah, and it won't which exactly, which is yeah. perfect. Um, and yeah, the true. other thing that I just wanted to put on because Esther wanted to show this. These are from Lancome. These are amazing. You know the juicy tubes that you shake? No. Oh, you've, you've got to try these. Well, these are amazing. Surely you know a mouth. juicy tube that you no, shake. No, no, I And you don't. simply, it comes in a little, can you see that little tiny sponge applicator? This is lipstick. Yeah, it's a lipstick. Really easy. And you simply just pat it on and it gives you a gorgeous stained lip. Just wow. Like, for me. It's so pretty for this time of year because it's really nourishing as well. But I just love the application. You shake it so it gives you more product. And it just comes in this tiny cute. little... Cute! Really it's cute. It's so pretty, isn't it? And it's it a looks lovely gorgeous. colour, actually. Nice summer red. And look how bright her eyes look. But no, it just look the same as you just put ordinary lipstick on? Is no, it just a, like a, a novelty? No, because it's texture. We like oh. it. And, and it shakes. And you shake oh, it. Oh, I see. Yeah. You guys, you'll <laughs> buy you, anything. Thank, Thank you, Thank you, ladies. Thank you very much. Very gorgeous.